Hello. 2018, when everything went absolutely mental. A lot of people are talking online, but for the first time ever, we're bringing you our guy, Ferdy. How you doing? Nice to meet you, mate. Thank you. And for the first time on your camera, never seen ever before, we have got the guy who was coming fast. JJ, how you doing? So talk to me. Can you explain this whole thing from your side? This was just by a project from my college. I had to record myself doing a cycle from the destination to the college and back the other way. And this happened to happen in that journey. So talk to me about the day. Like, what was going through your mind? Well, well first of all, I was late. College. Very late. Um, I was just trying to get there for us, as we all know that. And I buckled on the wall. He was the safest thing to land on. Birdie. Yes. How did the events go from your side? I do understand a long thing here. One sec. What is the high risk for? What is the high risk for people wearing it? You want to have that argument? You shouldn't have your tools on the front. I'm not arguing. <laughs> I'm just asking one simple question, mate. Street, it's a public road for everyone. The words come to my head that day. When I come out from my house, I said, some voice is like, put a high result in case. Didn't help, did it? Didn't help. You just come and crush me. And you said to me, sorry, it's an accident. But I lost myself for a sec that time, a second. How, when you got hit, when you felt the impact, yeah. how did that feel? That's why I just said, I lost myself for a few seconds. That's why I'm trying to find out myself. Uh, that's why I've been holding my head all the way down to finish with you as you finish it and uh, I'm just trying to like am I alright or not? Am I alright or not? And then the words comes out from my mouth which is I, I didn't realise what I was saying also Changing What was you it. fixing? I was checking the brake pads Did you check your brake pads before you left? <laughs> <laughs> no, the answer to that question already So when you first hit into Ferdy what went through your mind? But I didn't know what to say You already said sorry but that wasn't enough <laughs> So since the video has come out, right, a lot of things have changed, especially for you, Mr. Ferdy. Not too much happening for me. It's like just the people on um, house side, they want to take the picture, they want to make some Snapchat or some videos or something like They want me to say the word, why are you coming fast, don't go anywhere, this and that kind of thing. Because they enjoy I see but how they enjoy it, actually, yeah. Um, it makes me happy as well. I was thinking before, like, um, is people going to hate me or what? They keep saying to me, why are you coming fast? Then we found out, no, it's the opposite. They enjoy it. They're loving it, actually. That's your question. How can you go from wanting to get my video taken down to enjoying it as much as you are? How could you put that video into the YouTube without my permission? Oh, that was hilarious. I'm not going to lie. Uh, you remember what happened after I turned off the camera? Yeah, yeah. the police came after. I said, okay, I'm going to call the police. All right, the police, when the police came, I asked the male police officer, do I need to go to hospital? Look at this, my head. Is it all right or not? Is it too much damage or not? And he asked me about you. He said to me, he's a schoolboy in Asia. If you really want investigation about him, you can take him to court or anything like that. If you want. Or if you want to forgive him, it's up to you. He asked me. I, I just told him, all right, if, his, um, if my head is showing, all right, nothing, big matter or something, then all right, I'll just forgive him that. I said, well, what did you speak with the um, lady? The guy, the, the guy said to me, I would have got done for GBH if I wasn't recording. The police officer actually said to me as well, I could have got you prosecuted for throwing my bike. Uh, excuse me, think about I could die. <laughs> well, what are you going to say about this? I could die. You never know. From the heart attack, you never know. Think about 60, 60, 70 years old man and fixing the tire or brake pads and then you just and then hit him. How old are you, sorry? Example, 60 or 70 years old man changing the tire or brake pads. You're not 60 pads. or 70 though. I'm not, but think about that way. Is the bike important or my head or my body or my life is important? Tell me. You can buy the bike again, but you can't buy the person again because you're about to the earth. If it was anybody else, what do you think would happen if you defraud their bike? No, no, no. You put that video into the YouTube if you want me to talk openly as a face-to-face, 
after the face to face we can do chest to chest no problem <laughs> but i'm gonna say this especially because when i throw you back you got angry after I inside got angry. you me yeah inside you you don't show but inside that's why you put this video into the youtube so like you, you think up, i put the time. video on youtube out of spite because i didn't do anything to you when you threw my back you already make a blood on my head you didn't do nothing with you but that's why i got what about if i did punch you that time instead of the bike is it better tell me better oh, throw the bike <laughs> you see i don't hit you i don't touch you i don't make any damage on you damage the bike, Talk the bike. The sorry my language <laughs> i can get you another one yeah let's go now let's go get another one for you i'll hold you to that yeah uh, you see i can get it <laughs> but if i damage on your head or uh, eyes or teeth how are we gonna get second? Or cut your lips? Anything? You no, can get it back to normal, go. original again. No, but bike, hundred times you can buy it if you want. Very rich man. <laughs> so, so Ferdy, what happens now? What happens next? It's about a thing that I have next. If the people want it, if the people don't, they don't want it. Nothing will happen. I'm just going to live my life. And JJ, what about you? What's next for you? I've got a diss track coming for you, buddy. Are you joking? Nope. The preview is dropping on my Instagram right now. Yeah. It's uh, at J underscore W E A S Y. Feel yeah. free to check it out. You need to speak to my managers about this. I can make decision. I can't say yes or no. You need to speak to him. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, that's why I have to. I have to tell him to contact you. Whatever. Right. Heard it here. The saga goes on. What happens now? We have to wait and see. Ferdy? Yes. Thank you very much for thank coming. Thank you very much. All the best. For all that, all the way down, you came here and then asked me the question. Actually, I'm happy if I could answer it correctly. Done just fine. Thank you very much. And JJ, it's nice to finally see you, to meet you, thank the you. people. So, men, we've had a great discussion. Will you shake each other's hands? I don't have a problem with that. I don't have a problem as well. I can't even stand up. Thank you very much.